Hello, people of you, welcome to the circle. Two reviews. Today, I've been talking season 3, episode 6, Fellow the Right of Reddit. The Mount Hatter is back in this and he's playing a little game to go all the way with soon, which people should live and which should die. So, sort of like uh, the third episode of the first season of Sherlock, where Moriarty said the same thing. Except you have people talk for him. Moriarty. Uh, and they play a yes, guy with probably bleached white hair and a white dead suit. And that's him and I to get what Gordon did. Do something. But they see the white furry rabbit. And they so then he just fought Gordon just following from his clues and that. So. Hmm. And also in this, uh, it shows the birds like he's getting crazier because when he's interrogating the hypnotized guy, he actually bends the bell table. Of that bell share. It's only a, a few episodes away till the hinges come off, isn't it? And uh, also with Penguin, he trying to get out the nerve to tell uh, Edward his feelings, but can't. And um, when he, he and Edward are going through a school and he's talking to Kid who isn't playing with the others. He tries to encourage him to do it, but the other said that he doesn't, if the kid, other kids don't like him, he, they, he can always put him upstairs. That's a good thing to get, isn't it? Just put kids that you don't like downstairs. Oh god. And after that, Penguin does invite uh, Edward to Dinner. I do to ask one question. Why does uh, Penguin have a maid or whatever that doesn't speak a lick of English? It makes no sense. Like, I understand they want to get Spanish or something, but I can't really tell what type of language he's speaking. Oh. Uh, Penguin is sort of, uh, taxing what he's got to say to Edward while Edward getting the wine. And that's where he meets a woman that looks a little like Miss Kringle. Not creepy at all. I feel like real as well. Yeah, I get in the new love interest. I look like it's all woman. Crazy people! And uh, then, and uh, my heart kidnapped uh, Lee and um, Battery, and they have a bit of a talk. And it's kind of funny where uh, Lee said that Battery and Gordon are made for, or Battery is made for Gordon, and they said it's all conference. He's just funny. And the same with the the four them around the table while my heart is thinking of the tea party it was great. But I just like it that my heart is Ryan in, in his senses. He's like one of the few villains that he actually works with. It's just sick. Um, when Gordon them to the, which one of the girls he likes, he, he loves, I heard that's just the suit this girl loves the suit. And the suit's late, and he said the suit lay, but I actually, I heard that's the suit's, uh, battery. And then he escapes! Again! And then Valerie gets put into surgery, but, uh, Lee's, uh, fiance, he's gonna come, he might pull through. 
and no proof I am this. I get it that I might not do proof in every episode, but I still like to see what he's doing. Even if it's sort of one scene. Ugh. This is a good episode, pretty good into this a little bit of psyche in that Gordon, and I just love it when uh, he goes in to uh, have the and uh, Barbara's uh, club and starts breaking its shootings. It is good. I don't know why, but it is. I just wonder when I got being pushed back because Tabitha did say that she has him in a safe house or something, so. Or even that soon. Anyway, this, as I said, this is a good episode, and it seems like Matt Hatter is going to be the big bad of the first half of the season. It makes sense since the online title of this season is Mad City, and I think Matt Hatter is one of the mad villains, mad villains that the Batman Rotary it has. Yeah, probably said I'm wrong, but yeah, okay. I mean, I get it. Nine. Out of ten, just because they brought back, or seemingly brought back Miss Kringle. And then, might be, might be a different character that she looks like, um, act a little like Miss Kringle, so. I don't know. I mean, that's re that's the uh, episode. Gordon is seeing some hallucinations and I think why because of nervous somehow, but that's why I see how that is. Anyway, until that time, I'm a two. Okay.